Okay, everyone, welcome back to Game of Thrones, not the TV show, the mod for Medieval 2 Total War. There we have some uh, Lannisters. Those aren't gold cloaks, they are Lannisters, aren't they? Alright, now, ah, yes, thank you, thank you for uh, pointing out that I had forgotten to move my blasted capital from Storm's End. Right, um, is it affecting us that much? We're losing uh, close to 2800 and I definitely should have moved that, shouldn't I, once I got Renly up here in King's Landing, because there he is. Uh, it took a lot of work capturing King's Landing, so we might as well go ahead and um, make it our capital. Uh, we're not going to have to pay anything. Right. Set this element to be the faction capital. Done. Right. Uh, it saved us a tiny bit of money. Also, I need to do control in, don't I? Make that go away. Yes, the uh, Targaryen script kicked in uh, an episode or two back. Two episodes back, I think. And we need to kill Grey Worm. Or oh, I need to kill Grey Worm because I hate Grey Worm. And he's out in here, I think, in, what was it, um, Duskendale. I think he's in there. What's in there by himself? We've got Marek Swan going after him. You should be able to get that done. Let's go and look at our scribe, who has uh, been sent off to this tiny little island. Um, and look at what he has to say. King Scribe. The scribe keeps track of the rise and fall of kings. House Stark has its own king, yes. And I believe it is uh, Ned. House Joffrey is no longer king. House Greyjoy is no longer king. So if House Greyjoy does declare um, for the crown, then I think we have to go off and kill him, whoever their king is. But uh, we don't have to worry about Joffrey because he's dead. But yeah, the Starks have declared... And what am I doing there? Oh yeah, I'm going after that Martell fleet. Wait, that that's my fleet, isn't it? About to... Oh, they're literally uh, one tile away. Yeah, we're going to have to sally out down here. Uh, we outnumber them, but we have trash, trash troops. And we were going after this settlement, which is Night Song. Yeah, we apparently need that for our victory conditions. I've got a spy there, aka Outrider. Mm -hmm. You have landed there. Did I land you there to go after them? Why did I land you there? I landed you there for a reason. Because we did sack Ironwood, didn't we? Yeah, we can't destroy any more of their buildings. There's a lot of buildings in there that we can't destroy. No, because we got a Davos up here going after my song, and there's Davos the air. Right. Now, where are my other agents? Right. Got a friendly diplomat there. Do I have any more agents? Maiden pool region. Okay, you're up there. I need to get you over here. Because I think Ned is over here. I'm pretty sure Ned is their king. We'll find out soon enough. Right, you're down there. And you're up there. Right. Did change my capital affect any of my other settlements negatively? Nope, they're all in the green apparently. Which is good. Only saved us a tiny amount of money. But yeah, we now have our capital here. We've got twelve and a half thousand left over. We could get another diplomat, but I don't think we need them. We killed off the rebels that were up here, didn't we? Yeah. And we've got you coming over. Right. Axel, Lord of Dragonstone. Ah. Probably move you. Pass your title off. I should have passed it off to you. 
You know what? It is useful having that title, isn't it? I'm going to have to send you back. Right, so I guess an intern. Then we go off and try to kill Grey Worm. And we find out where the Stark's King is and go and kill him. Now we are still trying to push on to 1500 subs because that's a fancy round number, isn't it? Or half of a round number. It seems pretty good. Master Horse Breeders Guild at Storm's End. But would that really benefit us though? Because we've moved our capital now. Uh, I mean, we can pay for it. We're making really good money. Sow's Horn. Where's Sow's Horn? Over there. Right. You want me to go over there? Um, I should have sallied. We haven't lost that many men. I don't know if we'll hold the arbor in any case. But we'll do what we can. Uh, it should be a good wine producing region if it's called the Arbor. Um, I don't really have any decent troops, do I? Wherefore aren't thou enemy? Right there. Okay, oh yes, this is another one of those uh, cool maps, uh, custom maps. Look at that, what's that doing there? Oh, is that a funeral pyre? Did they burn someone? That is cool, isn't it? Have they been sacrificing people out there? Or maybe it was a Guy Fawkes. My British viewers will get that reference. Uh, there's no point in putting stakes because they just have infantry. Right. That's cool, isn't it? Um, yeah, one of the, uh, the viewers commented that some of the custom maps may have issues. I have not run into any issues so far with any of the custom maps. Or custom settlement maps, I should say. Not yet, but then again, I haven't fought on all of them. Right. I mean, they are light infantry, but they aren't ironborn. That will be the tough one to take down. Probably do some flaming arrows. Yep, so if you've been watching and about 80% of the viewers are not yet subscribed, so that's a big load of potential subscribers there. Um, so if you're watching and you haven't subscribed, consider doing so. You're not forced to do so. You have free will. It is nice that you watch in any case whether you're subscribed or not and uh, keep commenting at least because there's a whole bunch of things that I don't know about the mod and the books and the TV show let's get some of them to do some flanking action I'm not going to do anything special, but we will hold them down. There they go, they're going to start dying. Rapido! Right, let's go back to hand to normal speed. How are we doing? Maybe lost 8%. Now uh, you know what, that's not going to be a good charge. We're making some progress against them. charge or not let's see uh, got nine of them nine of his bodyguard
I think there's a few more. Balance of forces evenly matched. Right, he's uh, actually run off over there. Then get behind him. And they'll suffer a morale penalty. I'm down to 67. Down to 51. Alright, I think we're going to get him. I think his name was Good Brother, wasn't it? Down to 48. He looks like he's trying to follow after you. Ah, that one broke there. Two of my units are broken. Three. Ugh. Hold on, lads. They're all breaking. Kill their general. Dropped him down to 38. Right, no one's rallied. Dropped him down, 26, that wasn't a good charge though. Get him on that hill and charge now. Keep at it. Was that there? That was their units. they broken. Right. Stop that. We, we've killed him. We've killed him. Ooh. Yeah. I mean, those were just levies. But we got them. We don't have to chase them. Well, you know what? They've got that fleet blockading our port so you know I don't want anyone going away let's get him some XP Forty-five percent casualty. Thing is, are they going to keep coming after the arbor? Uh, there's a dead king. Uh, you do not so. If they keep coming after the arbor, will it even be worth holding it? Because I don't think it's part of our victory conditions. Mercy, and I'll show you mercy. The end of a sword. Yeah, I'm going to get one of them. Try to increase. Right. Where are you going? As you wish. Building up those forces for some reason. I'd forgotten about that. Ooh, they've sent a lot of troops there, haven't they? Right, is he going to keep getting away from us? Looks like it. Alright, get back up to Dragonstone. Ah, oh, they pulled all their troops back in here 
and they look like they've recruited a lot because we'd wiped out most of them earlier they couldn't have recruited that many maybe the, another script kicked in I mean that's a good settlement to have I want it Right. Where's my agents? I think I was going to go and talk to them, weren't I? And make a payment. Alright. Is that where he is? No, it's Rob, King in the North, faction leader. Yeah. Right, but we can't see what his traits are, but he's pretty good. We have to kill him at some point. We have to kill him. Go on, spy on her. Right. Ah. Uh, was I going to try and get on that bridge then? Is that it? Where did he just go? Don't want you sitting around up there. Can you actually get through there? You can get through there and there. I'll probably just station him up on that bridge. Right, you are going over to Evensong. Hmm. Yeah, we do quite often get the um, option of getting the Cell Swords Guild. I want to say I have one somewhere. Could have sworn I accepted it at some point. But maybe not. I would like it in King's Landing if we could get it now. Make some better units there. Some of which we can't retrain here. Did we really not get anything constructed? Hmm. Alright. So we've got the Outrider there, we've got you here. I mean, we could try asking for a ceasefire again, but they're allied to the um, Targaryens, so I just don't think they're going to give it to us. They are sending a lot of troops up there, aren't they? Do I really want the Sow's Horn? Oh, there's no units in there. No units, apparently. Oh, okay. Are they happy? Well, that was uh, easy enough. And we got four units of galleys at our capital. Wait. Alright. Mission success. You have been rewarded with four units of galley at your capital. But we moved our capital. Up here. Uh, did it not recognize that we'd moved our capital? Well, that was convenient, I guess. How much are they costing us? 800 for that extra fleet. We'll find a use for it. Maybe there's something we can block Kenny down here. Uh, okay, well, we got an extra settlement out of it. Can't do anything with it. No unique units. We can send these ones up in there for garrison. Really, is that. We can get the archers as well. Yeah, 
some of those we can't get retrained. Hmm. Also, those ones we just can't seem to get retrained. Let's spend some money somewhere. So Twenty three thousand. We can find somewhere useful to spend it. Probably don't need that, but right. Dragon stone. That'll give us an extra spy, though. We're maxing out many of the settlements. That would give us an extra unit, wouldn't it? Hunting grounds, crossbows. I mean, we could build this one up. But again, are they just going to keep coming after it? That one we sacked. Hmm, I suppose we could get some artillery. We're going to get a wildfire ship at some point. Right. Now let's get some of those. Because we're a bit lacking in cavalry. Get one retrained as well. No, we're actually coming up past here, aren't we? With our fleet. I think that's it. There's not really much more we can do. Uh, so we're going to have to deny that, I think. I'd prefer it if it was in King's Landing. The Knights watched. Oh, look, um, the Tyrrells. Um, they've taken territory next to that settlement, to the west of it. I'm sure they, uh, it was new territory they just took, wasn't it? Alright, Gaskari, uh, he's not good, Alan Tarth, maybe another relative of Brienne, I'll turn you down, take Settlement, Maidenpool, up here, I don't really want to come up there, now they didn't sally out, and I think they would have been strong enough to potentially beat me there, but not now. He's just coming up there to transfer that title. I mean, we could get the Tarth Marines, they're good, but they can only be retrained up here. Volantis has fallen. Ah, the Alliance of the Slavers have successfully managed to defeat the Targaryens. Yes, good. Um, for those of you who don't know, there is a, um, a script with the Giscari showing up uh, with a scripted army. And uh, apparently they've taken Volantis. The masters and slavers of former Valeria and Giscar will rejoice for this victory, although they know that the war is not over. The Mother of Dragons wasn't present during the battle, and if she comes back, she will bring fire and blood to her enemies. Right, that is right over here. Right around there. <coughs> uh, get some of the best units. I'm not really interested. Oh, see? They've come back with a bigger army. You know what? 
that just doesn't seem worth it, does it? Um, I mean, who do we have there? Marek Seaworth, I guess a relative of some devils. I'm going to take him out. Now you might ask why I'm taking him out. But they may ignore him. And I may be able to get this fleet over there to pick him up. Which will take four more turns. Now they've got a strong army over here, um, three armies over here, but the Turrells are coming. And we are going to try and get some extra units. Nothing to fear, so you say. Alright. You should be garrison. Uh, if we can upgrade it. Are they just going to sit there for five turns? It doesn't look like they should do that. There's some small folk. And, well, still haven't found anywhere to get those retrained, have we? Right, go and spy on her. Yep, we got an extra couple of hundred, I think. But you're going to come on over. A bit stuttery there. Tully diplomat. Yes, my lord. Do you come bearing a treaty? No. This proposal lacks a. Ah, it was her brother that we just killed, wasn't it? Still can't see what he's got. Mm. Yes, sire. There are a lot of Starks around here. Ah, now we can. Well, we don't get to see his uh, traits and retinue. He's got Stark bodyguard. Yeah, a lot of retraining. Giscari and Free Cities of Bravos in the war. Right. Well, we didn't construct anything either, did we? Um, so there's going to be a big battle here because we need to capture and hold Night Song. We'll wear them down. Your orders, sire. Approaching their dignitary. You are lucky we will receive you at all, infidel. We're going to lose the arbor. The Sultan has killed men. Point Probably. Right, well, capture Duskendale and I guess we'll go out to Maidenpool. And that'll mean that we have everything out here. That's, that's a Tully. That's a Bolton. We're not at war with either one. So we'll have this whole area. Plus all of this. We've got three um, somewhat decent fleets. And then I guess at some point we have to push over and kill out uh, Rob. Can we sail up here? I don't think we can get our ships past here. Because that would be useful, wouldn't it? Hmm. Right, we'll end it there.